Alrighty, so, um, you know, whatever. This is where it gets a little bit annoying, okay? I don't expect to change your mind. You know, it's whatever, you know, it's just, it is what it is. How could there be morality, rights that exist inherent in reality? You need to explain how these things could possibly exist in a reality without a god or an intelligent creator. It sounds a lot like a religious argument to me. It makes absolutely no sense to me. I cannot understand this whole... The reality... I don't understand where this comes from, this whole idea that there is somehow morality in reality. You know, I don't... I mean... I just, it makes absolutely no sense to me. How did it get there? How did it get there without something to put it there? You know, that's, that's the part that confuses me. My philosophy, moral nihilism basically states that there are no normative truths. Even if these truths are inherent in reality, even if I were to grant you that, how are people able to go against these quote unquote objective truths without consequence? If slavery is an inherent wrong, why has it been considered an acceptable practice for thousands of years? How have these people been able to carry out slavery without any repercussions to themselves, right? The world was not crafted by forces that even have a concept of it, if that makes sense. Reality without a god or an intelligent creator it makes absolutely no sense to me. I'm a drama whore, you know, I don't pay attention to all this stuff. It's fucking frustrating. It's like a brick wall, you know, in our communication where the ideas we were passing back and forth to each other were not getting through. So Skep and I, so Skep and I, this all started on a video Skep made. Skep and I, Skep's video, Skep, Skep said no. I think that's pretty much the gist of it, correct me if I'm wrong me or skep for that matter we ask her this question is god necessary for morality i'm gonna let him speak for himself furthermore i do not accept that principles such as fairness are set in stone principles <sighs> anyway enjoy or not enjoy have a good day there's a fact of the matter with regard to whether or not it's wrong to harm people, whether it's wrong to rape, for example. I think it's wrong to rape. I take this to not just be a matter of opinion. It's not as though if I thought otherwise, rape would be okay, or if everybody thought otherwise, rape would be okay. Rape is wrong, full stop. If you're worried about whether there could be genuine morality, where there are facts of the matter, on an atheist account, I'm inclined to think, well, of course there can. We might wonder, what makes it wrong? And the answer is, well, it's wrong because, for example, rape is wrong because it harms the victim.